Hello, welcome to Kim Dragon Put Paradise. Happy Thanksgiving. Today, I'm very excited. Would like to share with you another new additions to Mr. John Burnett Creations. Kinsley. So Kinsley, uh, one of the sister of Connie G, Fiona, Queen Daenerys, Emily, Jonathan Cotton Candy, and Celeste. So would like to share with you today, and I'm very excited, and look how beautiful this fruit is. Look at Kinsley. Can you see that color of the fruit? Look at that black, beautiful emerald green, long rack around that black, have an outline of kind of pinky red. Now look at the skin color. It's very hard for me to describe this color. So because it's in late season of fruit, so we're into fall now. So a lot of fruit is really changing color, ripening are different. They have more darker tones. So I'm really not sure how truly this color, if it really in season of the fruit, like in the summertime. So now what I can describe this color of the fruit is more toward like burgundy with a little brown or coral to it. But what you can see when I put the intro in the video, I show you the flower. And the flower have, the outer petal have a lot of very unique color with a little of chocolate brown, the outer petal and the base. And the inside, the inner better have a lot of coral tone to it too, coral pink. So that, I think that cause of that, the color that came out to this fruit, I pick up a little bit burgundy and brown kind of autumn color, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You see the, the flower is so beautiful. And um, that's very unique, the flower. And now I come with the fruit. So let me share with you about this fruit, okay? So um, I didn't expect anything with this variety gonna bloom late, you know, this season at all. So I surprised because that time in August, the weather was so humid, so hot, and this flower bloom in 20 days, from bud to flower bloom 20 days. But then after the bloom in, um, I believe in close to middle of September, but then the weather will change in a little bit, hot and cold and cool. And suddenly the fruit growing slower, take a long time for them to ripen it. So this fruit is about 70 days, 71 day today, actually, 70 day yesterday and 71 day I harvest this morning on Thanksgiving day specials. <laughs> Um, from bloom to harvest, 71 day. The reason why it's still firm, but since it's in the late fall season, I really don't know. And this is my first fruit of this variety. So I don't really know how to pick them. I don't want to wait too long because it's 70 day from bloom to harvest. So this is a long time for this fruit. So I'm just gonna try to give the best I can review, and I hope this fruit gonna turn out as good that I thought it ready. But if not, we still have next season to learn more about this new variety created by Mr. Dominic. So this fruit is not not bad on the, um, the size for first season of this fruit. It's almost 14 ounces already. So it's a good, decent size. You know, uh, we'll hope to next season we'll have even bigger. So just first fruit, it, look at that. So that's why I want to, sh to share with you today. And when I show um, close to the camera, what the fruit look like. So just give you an idea why I picked this, because the sister of Connie, of Kinsley, Connie Chi, sometimes they come with like this, this Kanichi, the color of coral. Sometimes it comes this that color, but then sometimes it can come to this 
more greener. You see, and sometimes those green, the carnitine green, actually it tastes very good. High in brit, this one take twenty one point four brit and carnitine. Even the skin green have you can see have a little resemblance of that sister Kinsley right there that have a little of that burgundy because it's late season. And then sometimes you can see certain fruit have more kind of coral. See? So it's, it's based on the climate can take the fruit ripen on a different color. I haven't experienced much with what pollen that can cause changing color. That's what I, a lot of, some of the growers say can be effect of the pollen can change the flavor and the color of the skin or a little bit lighter or darker shade of the, the flesh. But I'm still, still studying it. To do more studying, more research, more doing that, I will give you more update later in the next season. And then I will document more about it to see really the effect of the pollen can change in the flavor of the fruit or the color of the skin. So um, that's what I'm but my next study research about that. Cool. So what do you think? Are you ready? Oh my God, I'm so ready. <laughs> uh, if you guys have seen the branch on this one, it's beautiful. Everything about this plant has been beautiful. The branch is gorgeous gorgeous so um you if you probably are gonna put some in the video um for you to see when i uh last time i did the introduction of this variety with the fruit and you can see how beautiful the branches already so let's get started <laughs> now what are you guessing uh, what the blush gonna be I think it'll be pink, but I'm. I want it to be white. You want to be white. It'd be interesting if it turned white. Yeah. But I think I believe Polly can be between magenta, pink, just almost like Connie G here, mm -hmm. or can be the similar like Emily's the sister. The Emily have a little light pink. Mm -hmm. Remember we did that. Like yeah. like pink have a little kind pale. of purple, pale, lavender, pink. That yeah. so. Cool. I'm excited to find out. Oh my god, I'm... What do you guys think it is? Put it down in the comments below. Yes. So, love the color. The waxy, shiny. That's good. See, I can tell. Oh, oh, what I say, magenta pink. Ooh, you can see that. Pale. You can see that. That could be white. Mm, <laughs> um, Let me show them the... See? So, you guys keep guessing. I think it's gonna be magenta pink, just like the sister, Connie <laughs> G. I see, I'm excited. I think it's ready. Mm. I can tell. The skin is thin. It's kind of dirty. I, when I put the knife and press it down, and I can say, see? Uh, wow. That's very close to what I wanted. Wow, the skin is, look at that skin. It's more so gorgeous. thin. You barely can see that skin color have a red tone there, but you see how then that skin is it's ready yeah, see this is coming up really wow. well on camera look at that how beautiful it is you guys now i'm gonna share with you this see it's similar like sister see the color the yeah. coloring is sister look at that that sister connie g there and you can turn the around with the skin color See, they have resemblance. You see that? So, wow. Wow. Oh. wow, see? And the flesh looks dense like Honey Mare. Yeah, but look at the C. Nice. Can you see the C from this? Are they similar to Connie G? Same size. Yeah, okay. Now, can't wait for this to. Uh, I'm gonna do a brick score testing, you guys. I'm so excited. And then look at that, the inner, um, in the blush, they have a little light like helping. In the middle. In the middle. Similar to kind of like Townsend. Yeah, like a Townsend pink. You know, sometimes you see that little bit here with SM32. Yeah. <laughs> wow, I can't go. wait. Oh, 
18.4. Not very, not bad at all mm -hmm. for uh, for the first season of the fruit in late. And 18.4. Nah, not bad at all. It's very good. The color is really I'm good. Now I'm excited. So maybe next season will be up to 20. Mm. You know? And I'm I'm worried about they taking so long ripen. I worry about it might germinate the seed inside mm. there, you know? But luckily it's enough. Yeah, no I think it, it seemed like perfect. And oh, the skin's so thin. See how thin the skin? You can barely this, see the skin. So we have 18.4 of Kinsley. Beautiful. So i very excited. Right, not bad, not bad. I'm excited. Very excited. At 18.4, I think the complex city of the flavor usually comes through fairly well. It's not mm -hmm. overpowered by tart or sweetness. You can get that in the middle. Wow, it's, it's super firm too. You see that, guys? Yeah, it is so good. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. Mm. Have the coconut flavor right away. Tropical, wow. Tropical flavor. Have a little acidic aftertaste. Boy, have that so much coconut flavor. Like Connie Mare. It's hard to blend coconut flavor with acidity because it gets it's hard, it's really easy to get lost. This one you can definitely taste the acidity and the coconut. It's very mixed very well. And I've been looking for one that had a mixture like this because like I said, once you get the acidity in there, you lose a lot of the tropical flavors. Oh my. So good. This is fun. This is like candy. Yeah. Not watering. So it is crunchy, see, and the texture is so firm. Oh my God, it's so delicious. Mm. Kind of like fruit punch. Mm -hmm. Sweet, mm. tart, a little bit like pineapple almost. It's really good. I want to finish all of this. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. I couldn't believe it. How beautiful this fruit and with almost like crunchy taste to it. Wow. But it's the, wow, have that wow factor here. The flavors come in differently than in Connie G. Mm -hmm. A little bit more pronounced, just mm -hmm. in a different way. Yes. They're all there, but these ones like kick a lot more. You can get that zing of the acidity, the sweetness. You can taste the tropical coconut. And then you're left with an aftertaste, like a tart. And then the more you eat them, the sweetness, the complexity, just keep bringing out more flavor of the sweetness of it. Mm -hmm. I have more, a lot of coconut, but then it's so unique. Complex. It come complex it's with the nard. Your... It's hard to describe and have a tropical mm -hmm. punch, food punch to it. Mm -hmm. You know, the Very acidic, loud. it's like, it's amazing. It's like, it's totally different than Nkanichi. Wow. So, wow, it's amazing. So, I just want to share with you, Mr. Don Manette, you did it again. Another wow. awesome, awesome. Um, variety another sister so i'm so looking forward for next season i have more sister ceiling hopefully we'll fruit next season yeah and we want to share with you so far most the sister are wonderful but boy wow. Kingsley, this one's on top oh, really good very good just like connie g it's very good queen in areas i mean it's so awesome mm -hmm. so I want to finish this. Mmm. <laughs> wow. The more you eat them or taste them, and that flavor to keep pine up behind your palate. It's mm -hmm. like sweetness and coconut and, and tropical. It's amazing. But anyway, make sure to hit the like button and uh, subscribe to my channel. Happy Thanksgiving and thank you for watching.